This morning, as fans around the world honor Jimmy Buffett, his family revealing more about his private cancer battle. The beloved singer known for embracing a carefree lifestyle passed away at the age of 76 after a four-year fight with the rare form of skin cancer, Merkel. His sister Lori now telling people that the two shared a cancer battle after she was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer around the same time. Lori, who is now cancer free, saying we shared a club that nobody wants to join. I am thunderstruck that Jimmy didn't make it. Lori posting on Instagram that soon before her brother's death, I told him I've known him longer than anyone on the planet. He smiled with those twinkling blue eyes and squeezed my hand. Also telling people that Buffett had to cancel shows because of his illness, but wanted to keep performing. And that love of music carrying him to the end. His final performance, a surprise for fans at Mike McFarland's Rhode Island restaurant two months ago. I was in awe. You can't make that up. The moment capping off a 50-year music legacy and empire. For his devoted fans, the Margaritaville philosophy was really a state of mind. Buffett turned that tropical island lifestyle into a billion-dollar brand. It pays off if you just keep going ahead. It's just steady journeyman work when it comes down to it. He rose to success by connecting with his audience, getting a star in New Orleans, and never taking himself or his performances too seriously. I made $150 a week and half price on drinks. And the first week, I owed them money. <laughs> Buffett ultimately finding success after settling in Key West. Buffett shared his talents with us here at Today more than a dozen times, forming a special connection with Al. Uh, we're still thinking about Jimmy Buffett, and we're still thinking about all those he transported to magical places. Magic that will live on for years to come in his song and spirit. Only time will tell. When asked how he could play Margaritaville thousands of times, Jimmy Buffett said it's because it's not his song, it belongs to the crowd. And now those crowds of adoring fans are honoring the music icon from Key West to Chicago to Margaritaville's nationwide. He'll be missed, guys. Oh, he will be missed indeed. We loved him here at the show. Em, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.